It's another Black Friday, everybody. Another Black Friday where people who have absolutely no respect for themselves and their own fucking well-being go down to a fucking store to find three BB guns that have been marked down 80% while everything else is the exact same fucking price. People, I say this every year. You're better than this. Have a little bit of fucking respect for yourselves. All right? Why don't you stay home today? Stay home. Chill out, you know? Enjoy the rest of your Thanksgiving weekend. You know, and then next next week. How about Monday night after work? Why don't you just waltz into the store? Step over the dried blood on the floor from last Friday. Just step over that. Walk in there and just buy something that you can afford. You know, there's no shame in it. There's no shame in being fucking, like, having money problems. You don't have to get hurt over it. Just fucking buy something that you can afford. And that's it. It's just shit. It's stuff. Like that fucking TV that they're saying used to be a thousand. Now it's only 40 bucks. You're going to go in there and do like fucking, you know, five grand worth of damage to your limbs trying to get to the thing. And then for what? It's a flat screen TV. It's not going to be worth shit in fucking two years. Two years is probably not even worth, well, maybe it's worth 40 bucks. I don't know. Here's my thing. The second there's a fucking line in pushing and shoving, I've always just said, you know what? Fuck that. Occasionally, I've fucked up. Occasionally, I've gone down to like, uh, you know, I don't know, Pink's Hot Dogs on fucking La Brea and stood in that line for 90 minutes to get a fucking hot dog that just tasted like a hot dog. And I was like, yeah, there you go, Bill. What'd you learn? Huh? What'd you learn? I'm trying to think what would be worth... I don't know, the planet's going to explode in fucking two hours, and then there's a 90-minute line. I would stand in that, but then I'm also thinking, like, all right, so then we're going to be up there in, what, outer space? Right? It's like 90% fucking men, you know, one black chick up there. Was there any other fucking women on Star Trek? Is that why Kirk always landed? Am I doing hacky material from the 80s? Is that why Kirk landed and fucking was so horny every place he went? Fucking them green bitches. Um, sorry. Look at these goddamn people. Jesus Christ, just grabbing at some big fucking TV, bursting through. I don't know legally how they're allowed to do this. Like every year somebody gets fucking hurt. It's like, how is this not inciting a riot? Black Friday, on sale from 8th to Friday, November 28th. Some sort of fucking TV. Everybody with their big winter coats. Look at this guy. Fucking three adults just completely losing their fucking composure. And then I love the TV cameras. They're sitting there laughing, watching all these fucking people. It seems a little less violent. Did you guys see the video clip of the woman just... <laughs> she's clinging to a... A flat screen TV as somebody else drags it down the aisle. She's got like, what the fuck are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, they hoard it up here. Cheerleaders keep crowds going at the Wembley store in North London. Oh, my God. This is England. I love it. They bought into it, too. Oh, that's tremendous. That's fucking tremendous. Just when you think we can't get any dumber, old fucking London comes in to fucking save our ass. Little Tyke's Playhouse. Well, at least he went there and got something for his kid. I don't know. I don't fucking get it. Anyways, it's not worth it. Do you know the other day I was looking uh, I was looking at cars, right? My wife needs a new car. And uh, I went in and I looked at the car. And as I was getting out of the car, another buyer comes along. He goes, what'd you think of it? It's like, what do you mean, what the fuck did I think of it? None of your fucking business what I thought of it. The salesman's right here. If I think of something about it, I got to negotiate. I'm not going to tell you that I like it. And then he gets in the car to go fucking test drive it. So, the, so then the, the, the fucking salesman's going, oh, well, you know, so what are we doing here? It's like, I don't know. What are we doing here? I just took that thing for a ride. That cunt just drove away in it. So now what? Now what? I'm going to fucking bid on the car against this fucking guy? Sell it to him. Sir, my friend, my friend. Yeah, go fuck yourself. And that was the end of the day. <laughs> I don't do that shit. 
I'm start competing with this guy. I, I, I honestly, I just don't give a shit. I don't give a fuck, right? Am I nuts like that? Am I crazy? Is that, is that insensitive? At some point, I'll figure it out.